Have you seen the Reynards file? Lovely to see you two. I can't find it anywhere. I must be in the office. Have you tried Jay? Yes, I have tried calling Jay. He's not answering, is he? Well, he did mention something about going out. Oh, great. So I've just had one of our best clients tell me they're changing supplier and he's, he's out. I'll have to deal with this myself. Oh, it's your day with Molly. I'll try not to be too long. Not Nick Hill. You're not the only one who's busy, you know. I'm up to my neck, innit? Yeah, and if I don't call them back with a better deal, they'll walk. Right, well, I'll find the file. I'll drop it off. There's no time. Look, you know how hard I've worked getting that contract? I'm not losing it now. What are you doing? I'm bringing her with us. <sighs> yeah, no, I I'm sure it won't be a problem. Yeah, no, I'll raise the order right away. Thank you, bye. Molly's gonna need a sleep, Nikhil. What? Well, yeah, the, the pram's in the back. Hello? Adrian Raynor, please. Yeah, it's Nikhil Sharma. Yes. Oh, hey, like me. Thank you. I'm gonna get the pram. All she needs is a sleep. Okay, thank you. You can't talk to me until five. What kind of power game is he on? Well, have you done the figures? Yeah, I've cut everything to the bone. Right then. I'll take the call. But I, I've been dealing with it. No buts. I can handle it. Hey, where are you going? I'm going out. If that's okay with you, leave the file on my desk. See? She's fine. Christmas <laughs> after all. Okay, I've left Jay the notes. Tell him not to do anything stupid, just stick to the figures. Yes, I will. So you can take Molly home. Maybe I should wait. No. I mean, seriously, you should go. Molly has been here long enough. Oh, you've been so good. I hardly knew she was here. Yeah, I might as well wait until Jay gets back. No, there's no need. I can tell him. You know, maybe we could do a little crash, travel cot, a few toys. He'd love it. You're not being serious. Why not? If Jay can swan off whenever he feels like it, maybe I should be around a bit more often. Right, OK, well, then maybe we should start thinking about finding a playgroup. What for? Because... Because while you've been salvaging Reynards, I have done nothing. No new orders, no sales figures, nothing. Get into a routine? No, Nikhil. This is work. Molly is home. They don't mix. And how do you know if we don't try? Ed, it's nothing new, so you don't have to do this. I know. I want to. <sighs> Where the hell is he? I don't know. But Reynards are going to be calling soon, so we best hurry up. Yeah, well, I've told you you can go, so... Yeah, well, I told you I'd rather wait, give me the figures myself. I've got a meeting in Wakefield. Can't hang around here, I'll miss my train. These are the numbers he's asked for, can you make sure he gets them? And you can use your spare time to look at some nurseries online. Look at her. We don't need a nursery. Having her in the factory won't work, and we both know it. Right, well, then we need to make sure our days at home are at home. That was the idea. We've only been doing this a short while and we've already come unstuck more times than I can even remember. Jenny, keep your voice down. You're going to disturb her. Give the playgroup idea a bit of thought, please, Nikhil. I don't think we need to. Well, I think you're wrong. Since when did you ever listen to me? I want to see... Maybe this is a sign. I mean, you said yourself, juggling Molly and her jobs, it's, it's not working. Yeah, so we do what every sane parent does and get childcare. Yep. And you're looking at him. I love spending every moment with her, and I'm pretty good at it. So, what are you saying? I'm saying that Jay can get as angry as he wants, cos I'm gonna be a stay-at-home dad. Right, we'll talk about this later. Hi. Brew? Oh, thanks, I'm fine. Let's just get to it. OK, I need to tell you something first. Me oh, me first. We lost a lot of money today, thanks to you. Me? You took the call. Cos your priorities are wrong. Believe me, my priorities are just fine. I told you to get this childcare thing sorted. Yes, and we have. I'm gonna be Molly's full-time carer. What? Can I just say that we haven't agreed and we're looking at nurseries? I thought you'd at least have an apology. I don't care. And that's my point about Reynards, about your opinion of me. Yeah, well, you should. Cos, as far as I can see, this is just another stupid idea that you're dropping on me. Right, I'm doing this for my daughter. So to hell with you. 
You get one shot at being a father, and I'm not going to mess it up for you or for anybody. Right, fine. Whatever. So that's agreed, then? Do I even get a say? 